How do you make your Glendale fir from tree time look just like this picture? This video will show you how to do it. It's pretty straightforward and you should be able to accomplish it in under an hour. The Glendale fir is a full shaped tree that has a layered edge making it easy to hang large ornaments on the outer branches without those decorations resting on the foliage below. But it also has a dense center making it impossible to see the trunk of the tree when it's shaped properly. Here you see us working on the final branches of the bottom section. We start off at the center of the tree grasping the main branch near the hinge and work outward until we come to the first of the soft fluffy tips. These tips are pressed up against the main branch when packaged for shipment, so pull each one away from the main branch wire and fan it out to fill the space above and beside the branch. Move further out the branch to the next grouping as you complete the shaping of each cluster of two or three tips. As you shape each cluster, offset the tips so that they provide a complete visual block inward toward the trunk of the tree. Each of these tips that are deeply set into the center of the tree should be shaped perpendicular to the main branch itself, straight up and out. As you work your way outward on the main branch, begin to tip the branches toward you a bit, more like they would grow on a real tree, outward and upward toward the light of the sun. The outer branches on this design are molded polyethylene and look just like the needles of a natural fir tree. These branches should be arranged to naturally fill the edge of the tree in a way that results in the intended layered appearance. Work up through all levels of the tree until you get to the very top, blending each layer appropriately to achieve the appearance that you've seen on our website and in this video.